And again, like, I, I, I can respect the Pokemon Trainer uh, pick, you know. A lot more combos with Squirtle, you know, kill power with uh, Ivysaur, and then just, like, raw, raw kill power with Charizard. Yeah, Rob is actually really, um, really scary. I feel like his options, like, his damage output's crazy, and with how safe he can be, um... Rob just scares me in general, but I feel like with uh, Ivysaur 2, it's going to be a lot better um, for Haunts here because especially utilizing uh, Razor Leaf, different projectiles like that, I feel like it could be pretty even. I like the whole uh, Ivysaur-Rob right. matchup. I don't think it's too bad for Pokemon Trainer. Right. Oh, but getting sniped by that bear right there. You know, I feel like Hanzo's, like, not quite familiar with this matchup yet. You know, he's kind of just, like, He's Trying just going to throw a Razor yeah. Leaf. Yep, let me just throw it out. If you're throwing out projectiles, your gyro, I'm going to be throwing out my Razor Leaf. Right. And it's really good. I like you going for the Nair there. Ooh, grab Ooh. into up air. Let's, okay, let's go. That was pretty clean. Ooh, Usually we, we we see those uh, down throw combos into, like, right. uh, up air, up air, which is good damage. But I like the mix-ups. Oh, gets carries both of the hits and, unfortunately, not going to be able to do much about it. And goes into Charizard, hoping to get a grab or something. But... No, just a, wow. Okay, gyro clanked with a full <laughs> wait. I mean, who would win? A 200 pound fire breathing dragon or a little top? Yeah, I don't know about the little spinner top there. Yeah. Gyro coming out. That's interesting that that clanks. Yeah. Oh, Poor Charizard. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I feel like Charizard is going to really suffer for the matchup because of that, you know. He can't really get in just because Rob is all about, you know, the abusing that uh, Oh, down there. No, down there. Why don't we see the down air there? I, I feel, feel like, like he didn't have a double jump to do it, but he snipes him out with that vine whip right there. Oh, man, that gyro at the ledge is a little annoying. Ooh, I like that. Using the vine whip cancel to avoid the bit, uh, the dare. Yeah, Rob looking for these down tilts. Okay, down throw, up air. Clean percent. He's putting on a lot of pressure here at the ledge. Just right. scary for Hans. He needs to get out of that situation and out of the corner. Right. Oh, unsafe air dodge right into his face. I'm going to grab you up smash. Yep. And you did not mash hard enough for that. Yeah, down again. throw up smash. That is, that is not true. Dead. Yeah. Yet again, gets a quick bear out of shield. Okay, down tilt come out from Squirtle. Capitalize right. off stage. I haven't seen him. Did he charge his water gun? Uh, a little bit, but I think water gun is going to be kind of useless in the match. That's what I was like. Okay, yeah, he pushes him back there. Yeah. Kind of wants to create some distance, get him out of his face. Looks like he's actually doing pretty well with uh, Squirtle here. But the worst thing about Squirtle is that Squirtle dies super easily. Oh, so yeah, just the up air to up. Oh, my God, yep. He almost got that up tilt to up air combo and almost died for it, too, if he didn't get that switch in time. Okay, that drop down up B there. The Vine Whip is what we like to see at the ledge there. Super safe move for Ivy Sword. And I feel like players always forget about it. Okay. Gets a down, down throw. throw. Not going to be able to find anything off of it, unfortunately. Too high percent for it to combo into anything. Oh, I like that. Throwing up the top to punish the, the potential down air. Yeah, that was actually really smart of EC. And, um, oh, using wow. the bear to be like, okay, I'm avoiding your down air. I know you're searching for it. So let me just avoid it with everything I can do. Definitely Ooh. gonna have to flare blitz on the stage. He didn't want. He wouldn't have made it back if he didn't. All right, All right. made it back onto the stage. Those were Nair, and yet again, I like to see like bears off stage because it has that like little hooking J. But Ooh, get the four tilt so, instead. There we go. Yeah, I was looking for the off stage back air there, but yeah, the four tilt will take it as well. Right. Super strong move when it connects, especially at the tip, at the tail there. I mean, we Ooh. have Ivy Soar yeah. at one ninety five percent. You know, like any grab at this point, that'll be it. But. The gyro, too, applying right. pressure at just at the ledge. That's all he really needs to do there. Oh, no, that's going to be it. Yeah. Back throw. I, I mean, that's the first time I've seen <laughs> I know Rob, a Rob back throw kill. kill. Back throw. It's always like, Rob, is going to up throw, or he's going to down throw, up smash, or down throw up there, you. Yeah, throw but it out back at 200%. Throw. Yeah. Okay, well, man, easy, definitely. He's like, I'm, I, I know you're going to die, so let me just do it with the quickest option. Yeet. Yeah, he got yeeted <laughs> yep. for sure. <laughs> Oh, man. Yeah, that was a pretty consistent, uh, or not consistent, that was convincing, convincing. win there. Right. Easy, do, easy doesn't even look phased. He's just like, right, yeah, get it on with usual. next game. Yep. yep. Scary. You're, you're, Rob you're. is a scary character. I 
I have a hard time with him. A lot of people, I feel like, struggle with Rob right. um, in general. His I mean, definitely what you have to realize about Rob is that when he, he has to commit to that nair. His nair is his best move, but at the same time, like, you know that it's super destroying. Just don't challenge it. His aerials are great. His combos right. are great. He, ha he has cr great killing power and potential, and um, he just... He's also, like, can be his owner, too. Like, he has great projectiles. It's just he has a little bit of everything. Killing right. potential is crazy. Right. I feel like the one thing that Rob suffers in is, you know, that lack of landing options. And oh, the fact yeah, that yeah. he's, like, super heavy and, like, a fastballer, too, I feel like. So that he just gets combo for days as well. Yeah. But I feel like even with that, too, he doesn't really have, like, a, sh like a hard time landing on safely because he can kind of, like, you know, use the fuel, like, to his advantage and kind of mix up mix up his landing options. He okay, throwing up the gyro again, recognizing that uh, I feel like he baited that with the gyro to call out that jump for the fair there. I like seeing that. Ooh, good forward to throw him off stage. And I like what he's doing. He's going super high to avoid all the down airs that he can as possible. Ooh, falling out of that up air. It was right. a little awkward. Okay. Ooh, up air to up air, though. Like, that that's an interesting thing. I, I like how he landed with up air, like, almost knowing that he wouldn't do anything serious. And I just know, is that a UFO Ooh, in the background? Unfortunate. Is that a UFO yeah, right now? Yeah, I yeah. just noticed that. <laughs> Man, I've seen this stage too many times. To <laughs> yeah. Like, that, that is something I would expect to see in an Earthbound stage, not, not, not Animal Crossing. I'm excited for the new Animal Crossing. That's going to be cool. The yeah, Animal Crossing Island Adventure, <laughs> Bear oh, yeah. Girl style. <laughs> it's going to be super fun. Everyone loves yeah. Animal Crossing. But all right. Uh, already, <laughs> Han's already at the 70%. That spin dash move. Goodness. Ooh, just barely pointing that down there, but it comes up with an aggressive nair. It's a back air. Yeah, he, he wanted a uh, – sorry, I didn't interrupt you again. Easy was looking for that back air there, but a little laggy too. That's one of his uh, laggiest aerial options nice. there. But has him off stage again. Ooh, just – yeah, oh, I don't know yeah. about that. Uh, he was scared there. Um, he I mean, the dodged. deadly top was coming slowly mm -hmm. at him. Like, what else are you going to do off stage? That's, he, he was – he didn't – Easy didn't even throw it out, but yeah. that's why he was conditioning um, – like that option. as well, yeah, yeah, and it, it scared him. Uh, and yeah, it took the stock. That's what I'm saying. This game is so so many mix-ups. Right. Kind of it's about like outsmarting your opponent a lot of the times. Right. Oh, here's Ooh, the. Oh. I like that drop down with the gyro. That was good. You know, that's a classic Rob setup. You know, you would see Rob's go for that for days on Smash Four. You like, you don't really see a whole Rob's go for it nowadays. Okay. Like, nice I don't know. I feel like Rob's don't utilize that tech a whole lot. Yeah, and that was nice of Hans to recognize Rob's do like to jump there at the ledge. They don't really like to recover low, especially against Ivysaur. So he called up um, that jump with the up B there. Gets the up tilt to up air, and not going to be enough. Ivysaur is a little bit heavier than average. So yet again, it's going to be, oh, but there's, Ooh, yes, yeah, he's going to have to change up to Charizard. Yet again, I like that. Using the up B, but unfortunately going to fall into that up, our forward smash. And that will be the game, a quick 2-0. And now we have Gohan versus C-Sharp. Ooh, this is going to be this is gonna be uh, Mario versus... Yeah, I haven't seen Gohan in so long.